Keep watching Charis TV. Touch your ears. God will speak with you tonight. Kuluma na mindila lele. Kuluma na. Hey! Hey! Whatever that the devil has done in those years, I remove it. Jesus my tenant. Eh? How many of you, you want God to speak with you? I can't see your hand. Say, God, speak to me now. Say, Holy Spirit, speak to me now. You will hear boop. You will hear a sound coming out of your ears. Because your time to hear God has come. I say, your time to hear God has come. Some of you will hear your ears burning, 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 burning. You can take it down. So, you know, tonight God will speak with you. You know what happened? I want to tell you. God told Moses, he said to him, because your people, they don't believe. Tell them to go and bath. Tonight they will meet me. Because you also don't believe. I'm hearing something coming out of your ears. I'm hearing the voice of the living God. I say the voice of the living God is about to be heard in your ears. I can't hear you. Amen. Let fire enter those ears. I burn wrong voices. I burn wrong voices. Any voice that is speaking in your ears and is not coming from God, I destroy it in the name of Jesus. I destroy it in the name of Jesus. I can hear you. Amen. How many of you want to hear God? What do you want God to say to you? Huh? Because there's a special message tonight. Tonight. When you reach home, Holy Spirit will come and tell you, go and hide yourself in that room. Because I'm about to say something. Leave it, leave it. Because I'm about to say something. Many of you here you have been hearing voice of demons. You just hear in the middle of the night. Tonight I hear Holy Spirit telling you a clear message. A clear message from God. Because of the voice of God tonight, you are going to prophesy in the name of Jesus. You, you, are, going, you are going to prophesy over your life. Touch your ears. It is easy when you obey to follow God. Keep quiet, keep quiet a little bit. Because some of you, you will hear something even when you are here. Some of you are going to hear a sound. There will be a sound in your ears. One day Moses said to Pharaoh, he said, God sent me to you. He said, I must come and tell you, let my people go. Let my people go. Also today I want to tell you, demon, that release the children of God. 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 In Jesus' mighty name. There are people here, you grow up hearing something from God.
from nowhere the devil closed those ears because he knows that through you walls will fall because he knows that through you something extraordinary will happen he closed your ears i restore you today in the name of jesus i restore you today in the name of jesus i restore you in the name of jesus i restore you in the name of jesus i restore you in the name of jesus You know, I want to tell you this because I want to close. Many of us were thinking this thing that hearing from God is not a fiction. It's not a fiction. If someone say, I had God, that's why normally if not me, me personally, when someone comes to me and say, I had God, I don't intervene in that. Because a voice of God is a voice of God like it's a voice. It's not a fiction. Many people are thinking yeah, it's a fiction. People are, you know, they're just saying I had God. No. A voice. You see, now you're hearing me. God speaks like this. God speaks like this. Today, I want you to hear God. Hearing God is not only for prophets. Because many of you think hearing God is only for prophets. No. Even you, you can hear God. Huh? You can hear God. I'm sure you're hearing me. Hmm? Hearing God is not only for us. For anyone who's obedient before the Holy Spirit. Take your hands down. Say thank you Holy Spirit for revealing yourself in my life. I've been an obedient child for this long. I believe from today our relationship between me and you as my father you will start to show and you will start to speak like a real father i'm here i am listening speak god my ears are ready clap hands for jesus